Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. 90 Day Fiance Fan Shares Shocking Run-In with Ashley and Manuel 90 Day Fiance stars Ashley Michelle and Manuel Velez have been thriving in their marriage after facing some issues in Hiye Season 8. Many were surprised when Ashley admitted that it took her a year to file immigration paperwork for Manuel leaving him unable to work for a long time. It sparked speculation that Ashley doesn't fully trust her man. It seems the two were able to work things out behind the scenes. A fan even shared their run-in with the two in public, and many were surprised by their behavior. Keep reading to see what happened. Manuel made headlines last April after a fan discovered his job in the U.S. in a Facebook post a fan said they saw the 90-day fiance star at Home Depot purchasing construction supplies. Many fans are glad that he's now starting to make a living in the U.S. after being jobless for over a year. This also indicates that he now has a green card, and he can now provide not just for his wife, but also for his kids in Ecuador. A Reddit user recently shared their run-in with Ashley Michelle and Manuel Velez. According to the poster, she was casually strolling through Costco when she saw her favorite couple. She didn't waste the opportunity and approached them. The Redditor initially asked the two if they were Ashley and Manuel from 90 Day Fiance. The married couple looked so friendly and approachable. The OP even said Ashley was the one who asked if she wanted to take a picture. One fan said, oh really? They are together? Did they seem happy before you approached? What were they like? They seem very nice people. These guys are one of my favorite 90-day couples, the way they use as asterisk X to solve all issues, at least in the beginning, was very entertaining. Ashley is also just funny as hell to me. Another person added, love them. Ashley needs to replace Sean as host of the tell-alls. Lol Manuel is always so unbothered. Problematic King. Another commenter wrote, That's so awesome. Manuel Velez and Ashley Michelle continue to prove the doubters wrong. Recently, Manuel shared a clip of them on a movie date, showing that their marriage is still going strong. The 90 Day Fiance stars have also been living their best lives since the reality show. Aside from Manuel finally landing a job, Ashley has also been getting a lot of attention due to her weight loss journey. She even participated in a bodybuilding contest, and many were impressed by her confidence. The world of reality TV is filled with twists, turns, and unexpected encounters, but nothing could have prepared one fan of 90 Day Fiancé for their jaw-dropping run-in with Ashley and Manuel. A chance encounter turned into a surreal moment, leaving the fan with an unforgettable story to tell in some shocking insights into the couple's off-camera dynamic. The fan's fateful encounter, it was a normal afternoon for Rebecca, a longtime fan of 90 Day Fancy, who had been following the ups and downs of the show for years. She loved the drama, the culture clashes, and of course, the love stories that sometimes blossomed against all odds. Little did she know, her mundane trip to the grocery store in Miami would take a turn she would never expect. I had just grabbed a basket and was walking down the produce aisle when I saw them. Ashley and Manuel, right in front of me, Rebecca recounted in an online post that quickly went viral. At first, I couldn't believe it was them. You see these people on TV, but you never expect to run into them in real life. Ashley was leaning over a cart, examining a bag of oranges, while Manuel stood beside her, looking somewhat disinterested, scrolling on his phone. Rebecca, starstruck, hesitated for a moment before deciding to approach the couple. I wasn't sure if I should say something. I didn't want to be rude or interrupt them, but when are you ever going to get a chance like this? Rebecca wrote. Taking a deep breath, she walked up and greeted them, unsure of what their reaction would be. 
To her surprise, Ashley turned to her with a warm smile. Ed immediately recognized that Rebecca was a fan of the show. Oh my gosh, yes, it's us, Ashley said, laughing. We get recognized all the time now, but it's still so weird. The tension between Ashley and Manuel. What started as a lighthearted encounter quickly became something far more revealing. As Ashley chatted with Rebecca about the show, Manuel remained silent, his face tight with frustration. The body language between them was tense, something Rebecca couldn't ignore. It was obvious that things were awkward between them, she explained in her post. Ashley was trying to be upbeat and friendly, but Manuel just seemed checked out. I've seen them argue on the show, but this felt different, like something was really off. While Rebecca didn't pry, she could sense that all was not well between the couple. As Ashley continued to talk about their experience on 90 Day Fiancé and how much attention they had gotten since the show aired, Manuel finally broke his silence. Do we really have to talk about this here? He muttered, barely looking up from his phone. His tone was cold, and the atmosphere shifted immediately. Ashley's face fell slightly, and she gave a nervous laugh. Sorry, he's just not a fan of all the attention sometimes, she explained to Rebecca, but the tension was palpable. An unexpected confession. Just as the conversation was about to fizzle out, something unexpected happened. Ashley opened up in a way that no one had anticipated. Honestly, it's been really hard, she said quietly, glancing at Manuel, who had walked a few steps away to take a phone call. The show doesn't show everything. We've been through a lot, and some days I don't know if we're going to make it. This confession stunned Rebecca, who had always assumed that what she saw on the show was a relatively accurate portrayal of the couple's lives. Ashley, always the cheerful and optimistic one on screen, seemed genuinely worn down in person. It's like we're two different people now, Ashley continued. The pressure from the show, our cultural differences, and just trying to make everything work, it's exhausting. Rebecca, taken aback, listened intently. I wanted to ask more, but I didn't want to overstep. You could tell she needed to talk, though she later wrote in her post. As Manuel returned, still scrolling through his phone, the mood grew even more strained. Ashley seemed anxious, casting furtive glances at him as if waiting for him to say something, anything that might lighten the mood. But he remained silent, eyes glued to his screen, seemingly uninterested in the conversation or the fan encounter. The truth behind the facade. Rebecca's encounter with Ashley and Manuel lasted only a few more minutes before they said their goodbyes. Ashley gave her a quick hug, thanking her for being such a loyal fan, while Manuel offered a curt nod before pushing the cart toward the checkout. I walked away feeling... Strange, Rebecca admitted. I expected them to be like their TV selves, but what I saw was a couple who seemed like they were barely hanging on. It was kind of heartbreaking, to be honest. After her post went viral, other fans chimed in with their own observations, many noting that they had sensed trouble in Ashley and Manuel's relationship from watching the show. Some speculated that the pressures of fame combined with the couple's ongoing cultural differences, were taking a toll on their relationship. Reality TV doesn't show the whole story, one fan commented. What Rebecca saw was probably closer to what their life is really like. Others were dissympathetic, suggesting that the couple's issues had been apparent from the start and that they were simply not compatible. Ashley always seemed like she was doing all the emotional labor in the relationship, another fan wrote. Manuel clearly doesn't care, and it shows. What's next for Ashley and Manuel? Rebecca's shocking run-in with Ashley and Manuel has sparked a whirlwind of speculation among 90 Day Fiancé fans. Will the couple survive the pressures of fame and their personal struggles, 
or is their relationship on the verge of collapse? Only time will tell, but one thing is clear. What happens off camera is often far more complex and challenging than what we see on TV. For now, fans will have to wait and see if Ashley and Manuel can weather the storm. But for Rebecca, the memory of that tense grocery store encounter will linger for a long time. Meeting them was exciting at first, but it also made me realize that these people have real lives with real problems, she reflected. I just hope they can work things out, whatever they decide.